spring for con this event here for the uh, July 13th show, we have uh, two original Power Rangers, Yellow and Silver. They're here. Uh, we have some famous uh, wrestlers from the 80s, uh, the Nasty Boys. They're here, tag team champions. Uh, we also have uh, some famous comic book artists like uh, Jim Shooter, which was uh, Stan Lee's right-hand man at Marvel Comics for over 40 years. Uh, Mike DiCarlo that drew uh, Batman. And then we also have a famous Simpsons uh, comic book character, uh, I mean artist, uh, Phil uh, Ortez. He's here as well. So it's a good lineup of, uh, of uh, guests and artists here uh, for, this, for this show, for this small town. It's actually really good. Why Frankfurt? I, uh, long story short, uh, I used to come here as a kid all the time with my dad to watch the Derby in Louisville, but we would stay in Frankfurt because we'd go to the governor's mansion for the free pancakes there in the morning. So I've always fell in love with this town. So it was, uh, it looks like it deserved a good uh, Comic Con and it's done well. So Clips Little Clown is a character that I've created myself. And I go to different cons and events and just try to entertain people while they're waiting in line, while they're walking around. Just give them something else to look at. Yeah, so I'm also with a group called Cosplay for a Cause Network, which is easy to find on Facebook and such like that. And uh, what we do is we tie a bunch of the other cosplay groups together to make them aware of different events that we're doing. And we do like different parades and that, but we also go to like the Lexington Children's okay, Hospital go. um, and, and volunteer there. Um, if organizations like say there's uh, somebody want to do a breast cancer awareness thing, um, they could contact us. We'll come out there full dressed up in different superhero costumes and stuff like that and just be there as a as a eye candy to draw people in and we do it completely free. We just do it we, we, we have fun doing it. When I started, uh, well, I was 13 years old and uh, needed a job, and they won't give you a job in a factory when you're 13. So, uh, so I thought, what can I do? And I've been reading comics, and I thought, I bet you I could do that. Somebody must get paid for this. You know? And so I, I wrote uh, a, 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 and, and drew to the best of my ability a story. I designed the cover and you know designed some characters and stuff. And I sent it in to uh, the editor at DC Comics, Mort Weisinger. And um, and he liked it, and he sent me a nice little note saying, you know, you know, maybe maybe you could, you know, do stuff for us someday. Then I sent him. He said, send us another one. And I sent I sent him two more. And that would be these right here. And uh, and then I get a, a phone call from him, and he says, oh, we're going to buy these three and publish them, and I want to start using you as a regular writer. And uh, your first assignment is Supergirl, 12 pages next Friday, and there it is.